So Fortnite World Cup 2020 is going to be insane. We have huge news about it. I'm not going to waste any time, so let's go. So first off, I can't stress this enough. If you are new to my channel, make sure you guys subscribe. There are big things coming for Fortnite throughout the season, such as the World Cup. I'll be telling you guys all about it on this channel. So make sure you guys subscribe. You will not be disappointed by subscribing. I would love to have you on this channel as well. And with that said, let's get right into it. So starting off the video, I want you to comment down below real quick. Did you personally watch the World Cup as of last year in 2019? I want to know your thoughts on that. I would love to know, and I'm generally interested in what you guys think. I did. It was an amazing time last year. I loved every moment of it, and that's why I'm so excited for this one. So with that said, let's get right into the first thing I want to talk about, and that is going to be, is it going to be solos, duos, trios, squads? I have that answer for you. Well, partially. And we know this because one of the heads of competitive Fortnite at Epic Games, he changed his profile picture to this picture. As you can see, it is three skins, which means trios, and then the background is the same exact background as the World Cup, just different colors. So because of this, we can tell it's going to be trios and something else. That something else could be solos. Last year, it was solos and duos. We're going to have to wait for the official announcement. But speaking of that, we have an idea of when the announcement is going to be, and that's going to be March 25th. Let me explain why. So I'm going to give you guys all the puzzle pieces, then we can put them together ourselves. So first off, last year in 2019, when the World Cup was officially announced, they announced it on February 23rd, 2019. Well, they obviously tweeted it out when they announced it, right? Well, as of last week, they deleted that tweet officially off Twitter. You can't find it anymore on Twitter because they deleted it. That means something is happening. So puzzle piece number two, today even, Fortnite Competitive posted this on their Twitter. For Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 2, we're working to address performance issues impacting both clients and servers. Our goal is to improve performance before kicking off any cash prize competition. We'll keep you posted with any schedule updates as soon as possible. So this means that something big is cooking up, and the reason why I'm saying March 25th is because Fortnite posted on the official Fortnite Twitter, and this tweet is still up, this is your road to the Fortnite World Cup. Get all details here, as you can see, it was posted on March 25th. And I say March 25th as a last resort kind of thing. It'll come out any time before that. I hope it does. I'm just saying March 25th is going to be the last thing, especially because as of right now, there's some competition that, that this game called Valorant that just came out from Riot Games. It has so much hype around it. I'm just saying if Fortnite wants to announce the World Cup, it's going to be now. So the last thing I want to talk about is the prize pool. Last year it was 30 million as you guys probably know. This year it's going to either be the same or even more. I'm saying at the max 50 million. Anyways, if you made it this far into the video, I want you to comment the word pickle so I know. Drop a like on this video if you're breathing oxygen and make sure you guys subscribe. You don't want to miss anything coming out on this channel between Fortnite in general and the World Cup. You will not be disappointed by subscribing. I would love to have you on this channel as well. If you're participating and trying to qualify for the World Cup, I wish you the best of luck do not do anything stupid do not get clickbaited i'll see you guys tomorrow with another brand new upload and i cannot wait to see you there peace out